Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Backyard Beer Tastings. I'm your host, Beer Coaster Tony from the BeerCoastersPodcast.com. I'm in beautiful New Hampshire, so I thought I would bring you a delicious local favorite. Uh, this is from the Tributary Brewing Company. Now, I said new, I'm in New Hampshire, but I actually went over the border not too long ago to Kittery, Maine, where these guys are out of. Um, their website is TributaryBrewingCompany.com. And if you haven't heard of these guys before, let me give you a little backstory. So the brewmaster of the Tributary Brewing Company is the legendary Todd Mott. You think, do you know who Todd Mott is? Well, you should, because if you've ever heard of Harpoon IPA, he may have something to do with that. Yeah, he was the originator of that recipe. He also spent uh, many, many years at the Portsmouth Brewing Company, and he always had the dream to make his own brewery, to, to open his own place. And he finally made that dream happen in September of 2014. So I was uh, lucky enough to stop by uh, the other day. So I'm going to bring you something fresh from the brewery. Today I'm uh, going to have their pale ale. Their pale ale, uh, the ABV is 5.2, and the hops are Citra, CTZ, Nugget, Warrior, and Centennial. Uh, it was a crisp beer, and uh, according to the description, and we're going to give it a try. All right, got my nice. Yukon glass because it is game day for those that didn't know hopefully uh, we can pull something off against Kansas But eh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. All right back to the beer on the pour On the pour you got about a Yeti finger of head um, on the nose Clean crisp like kind of a you get those biscuity malts in the nose Honey, maybe a little bit. Uh, now it is a balmy 37 degrees outside here in New Hampshire, so maybe I can't smell quite well, but it's got that nice, crisp, clean, a little bit of sweetness on it. All right, we're losing daylight, so let's go in for the taste. Very clean. Uh, like I said, kind of like I mentioned on the nose, they had that crisp kind of nose, but mouth feels uh, dry. You get a little bit of that residual sweetness from like, kind of like, like maybe like if you had a biscuit with honey butter on it or something, or like if you have uh, Irish soda bread with a little honey butter, I'm getting that like, that honey butter sweetness. Very good. Not too bitter at all. Um, very nice usage of the uh, the hops. Um, they, they give it a, a, a very mild bitterness, but at 5.2%, I know this is going to be fairly easy to drink. Um, food. Uh, and we're losing daylight, so I'm going to go right to the food pairing. Mm. You know, I mentioned that Irish soda bread with honey butter. It just so happens... I have a little bit right here. Let's let's give it a try. Hmm. Hmm. Delicious. Delicious. And uh, yeah, definitely check these guys out. They're up in Kittery, Maine. Uh, TributaryBrewingCompany.com. Um, Todd Mott. Clearly, the guy's been brewing for over two decades, so he knows a thing or two about making beer. Definitely check them out. I hear they're on. They're uh, top 10 lists of main breweries to check out up and coming. They've only been brewing since September of 2014, so you got to check them out. Definitely. Oh, and uh, shout out to uh, Bryce and Katie Chamberlain. Uh, they just recently had me on their show, the Minute Beer Review. Uh, I'll put the link down there in the bottom there so you can check it out. Uh, they're great people. Um, so definitely check that out. And there's a dog in the way here. Hello. Anyway, let's get this out of the way before we're losing daylight. So also, shout out to the Yukon Huskies who are playing tonight. Yeah, that's right. I got my jersey on. It's game day. Yes. Okay, I'll stop. All right, that's it. So cheers for the Backyard Beer Tastings. I am Beer Coaster Tony. Have a good night.